Hi guys, in this tutorial, I will tell you how to send the automated welcome mails with custom templates in Django. Further, before we go into the project, let's check the Django was installed on our local machine or not. Further, type the following command py space minus m Django space hyphen hyphen version, which is nothing but Python admin Django version. So I'm using 3.1.4. So if not Django was not installed in your local machine, you can install by using the following command. Pip space install Django. Using this following command, you can install. So let's create a new project by using the following command. Python admin Django start project project name. As of now, I'm using project as my project name. So as you can see, the new Django project was created. So navigate to the project by using command CD project. So we have successfully navigated to the Django project as well. So in this project, I'm going to create new file, which is views.py. Keep it aside. So, to render our HTML templates, we need a templates folder. Let's create a templates folder like this. In this template folder, I'm going to create register.html and one more file success.html. All right, so let's go to the settings.py file. For use for automating mail, we need to configure the mail from which we want to send the automated mails. For that, I'm using the reference from StudyGAN website. So go to the StudyGAN website. So the link was also available in description as well. So if you're trying to configure the Outlook, which is Microsoft Mail, you can follow this configuration or if you want to use the gmail you can use this following setup i'm going to use this outlook configuration so just use it in our project so as you can see here we have to use our email id and email id password here as well so configure it. After configuring it, just go to the templates in settings.py. So configure the templates folder in this array. So nothing but we are configuring this template folder into this settings.py file for our Django project. So we have configured everything in settings.py file. Let's go to the urls.py file. Here again go to the study gain website and just copy this extra url paths present in the website space them in our project we are getting a warning for views to resolve it type the following input command from dot import views so we have configured everything in urls.py as well. So now go to the views.py file. We need to create those views, which we have configured in url.py, which are a register on local host path, which is single quotes. And second one is success view as well. So further, again, go to the study and website. In creating user registration, view use this import commands in views.py file and user registration view code as well so use this view in our project 
so let me explain in one minute what this view actually works so we are asking users to enter their credentials which are email and password and username so after they enter the credentials the django will start validating the credentials if the username that entered by the user was already existed on the database it will raise the message that username was already exist and again it validates the mail as well which is nothing but it checks the email was already exist on our database or not if not exist it will create a new user with the following credentials given by the user which are username password and email so after that we are sending mail by using this template register underscore email dot html is a custom template we want to send inside our mail so further we are going to create register underscore email dot html as well so after we are rendering that html in the context type taking that username as well and next email from the email from is from the mail which we want to send the emails which was previously configured in settings to pivot as well and we reception list is going to be the email which was entered by the user in the registration form so after that we are sending after the successful creation of account it will redirect to the success.html file so again for success we are going to create a view as well here create a new view with the name of success which have we previously configured in urls.py success of request return render of request comma template name which is nothing but the success.html so after the successful user creation it will read out to the success.html page all right for the email template go to the study gain site on this article as you can see download the ready-made templates by clicking here so click here it will redirect to some other page in this site you can find pretty much of free templates to send in our email i'm choosing this one so click on get started after click on getting started you can use this template of your personal choice you can edit here by live after editing click on export and you can download it in html template as well it will download in zip format after downloading the zip file extract it i previously used that so i'm just going to my templates folder and copy and pasting it so as you can see i got this page as a register.html template which i have downloaded from the briefree.io so here what you can do is just go to this line which is 351 line here what you can do is use the username which is dynamically entered by the user will be represent will be resembled on the email so we have configuring everything so let's start our server by using the following command py space manage.py space run server as you can see we got a warning that our tables database tables was not successfully migrated to migrate them stop our server and use the following command that py space manage.py space migrate by using the following command it will migrate all our tables into our database as you can see we have successfully migrated our tables into our database let's run the server now so go to the browser type the following address localhost colon 8000 so all right we got nothing on this page so now copy this registration html code from this website study again website and use it in 
register.html page all right now again go to the browser and refresh it as you can see it is asking for the details to create a new account so what you can do is enter your mail and username and your password just click on the submit it will take a mini time to send the email and create the account on our database so as you can see after the successfully account created it will show us success let's go to our gmail let's check our mail so as you can see we are using custom template and successfully got a mail with the username we have entered so thank you guys